Yo, what's happening guys? Coming at you from downforsoundshop.com and in this video we're going to tell you why you should stop blocking the airflow to your amplifiers because this is it's really a problem. Oh man, <laughs> every time we do these videos somebody comments like it's so sad that he's having to make these videos because obviously I wouldn't make it if it was just one person saying it. If it gets to me making a video about it, it's because so many people have complained about this or whatever, um, or we've seen it so many times in installs causing issues. It's crazy. So uh, one of the biggest things causing people's amps to overheat is it's usually uh, crammed in a very small space. Like for instance, they have like a extended cab truck and there's like this much room up under the back seat and they'll lift it up, they'll do the install and then they'll smash the seat back down on top of it. It'll be sandwiched like that or they'll mount it on the back wall and when they're mounting it, it looks beautiful and everything, maybe. And then they'll flip the seat back up and again, it's sandwiched in between there. It doesn't matter how many fans and cooling, how much we do, if, if, this thing is smashed in between two pieces of cloth or whatever how well can it breathe this essentially like you somebody putting or you putting your hand over your mouth and trying to breathe through it. it's it's not good so you need to make sure you're mounting it in a place where it's not even mounting it on a carpet floor is it can hinder the airflow because you can see right here on the mounting feet it's a little bit taller than the rest of the amplifier so there's a little bit of a lip right here so th that if it's mounted on a hard surface actually you'll be able to see it when i do it with this one can you see the light under here so if you're if you have it mounted on a um like a piece of wood like this or something that's not going to be fuzzy like carpet it'll be able to breathe under here and out the sides and dissipate heat like it should so that's a good thing like that we're trying to help you guys out uh, by doing that so um the other thing is <laughs> it seems so uh, self-explanatory stop blocking the airflow to something um but people will have their amps somewhere and they'll have clothes on top of them like just so much junk in a vehicle in my head i'm seeing like a post of like a hoarder's vehicle online that like the stuff's just piled up crazy um but anyway it's, it's like that like people just have stuff piled all on top of their amps and equipment and everything and it just can't breathe so i'm gonna cut this off so i don't keep going on and on about it but that's basically what you need to do the more you can get air circulating around it and even even doing external fans obviously going to help a lot um, but just make sure it can breathe and get air across it so you'll have your best luck with the amplifier staying cool and you'll be basing out all day every day so um yeah i think that's it all right appreciate your support at down for sound don't forget about the down for sound difference guaranteed lowest prices fastest shipping and best customer service we shall see you in the next one later happening guys if y'all enjoyed all the hot content that you saw in that video be sure to follow me on youtube facebook tiktok instagram under the life of price and also down for sound shop on facebook and instagram and don't forget snapchat i'm jpd4s on there so be sure to check me out there we'll see you in the next one later